Egypt is setting out on a remarkable journey, constructing the largest artificial river in the world in the dry western Egyptian desert. This huge project, known as the New Delta Project, is a very inspiring response to the severe water crisis that Egypt is facing. Let's dive into the details of this extraordinary project, its motivations, and the challenges it aims to address. The new Delta project aims to create a vast oasis in the scorching western desert near Cairo. Let's say you're lost in this arid landscape, desperately in need of water, and then, on the horizon, you see something extraordinary, an oasis stretching as far as the eye can see. This massive project unfolds in multiple phases. The initial phase, set for completion by 2025, aims to transform nearly 6,000 square kilometers of barren desert into a massive gigafarm. This gigafarm is not just about farming, it's a complete development. It includes the construction of new roads, residential areas, two power stations, and the world's longest artificial river, stretching an incredible 114 kilometers. The second phase, expected to be finished by 2030, will double the size of the reclaimed area expanding it to 12,000 square kilometers. What makes this project even more extraordinary is that the land in this area is fertile. It's just been lacking the water needed for sustainable farming and development. So basically, the new Delta project offers hope to a region struggling with severe water scarcity. It's an effort to not only address the immediate water crisis, but also to create a sustainable and prosperous future for Egypt. Egypt has been dealing with a water crisis, and it's the driving force behind the new Delta project. As we approach 2024, Egypt's population will reach 115 million people, a number that the country is struggling to provide adequate water for. The situation is dire, as Egypt faces one of the most severe water deficits in Africa. According to the United Nations, if things don't change, Egypt could run out of usable water as soon as 2025. What makes this crisis even more challenging is Ethiopia's construction of the Renaissance Dam, located near the border with Sudan. While Ethiopia's primary goal was to generate electricity, the dam's presence posed a substantial threat to Egypt's water security. The dam's strategic location, right on the border, introduces risks to both Sudan and Egypt. If this dam fails, it could unleash chaos in these two countries. The threat is so real that the new Delta project has been initiated as a safeguard. It's designed to absorb any potential disasters in case the dam collapses. To achieve this, the new Delta project is connected to the Nile River through gates and tunnels. These mechanisms can efficiently manage sudden rises in the Nile River's water levels. So, it's a safety net to protect Egypt from the catastrophic consequences of a dam collapse. The water crisis in Egypt is not a distant concern but an upcoming catastrophe. With a growing population and an already critical water shortage, innovative solutions like the new Delta project are not just ambitious, they are crucial to securing a sustainable future for Egypt. This initiative is a critical response to the crisis, demonstrating Egypt's commitment to tackling the water catastrophe head-on. Egypt confronts not only a water crisis, but also the pressing challenges of climate change and increasing desertification. The consequences of these challenges have far-reaching impacts on agriculture, livelihoods, and the economy. Approximately 20% of Egypt's land is suitable for farming, but only 5% is actively used due to water scarcity and the stress on water resources. This restricted agricultural space has led to Egypt becoming the world's largest importer of wheat, the second largest importer of yellow corn, and the fifth largest importer of cooking oil. Additionally, Egypt depends on imports for 100% of its lentils, 80% of its beans, and 32% of its sugar. The reliance on food imports presents a concerning scenario. Ideally, Egypt should be exporting these agricultural products, which would boost the country's economy and reduce its dependency on foreign sources. The agricultural sector is of utmost importance to Egypt, contributing 14% to the nation's GDP generating 28% of job opportunities and providing employment for 55% of people in rural areas. The livelihoods of nearly 40 million Egyptians, or about 5 million families, depend on agriculture, livestock farming, and the food industry. Therefore, addressing the challenges of climate change and desertification is not only an environmental concern, but a matter of national and economic significance. 
The new Delta project comes as a complete solution to these challenges. By transforming the desert into an oasis, not only secures water resources, but also provides opportunities for sustainable agriculture and economic growth. The project is expected to enable millions of families to maintain a reliable and secure source of income. Moreover, it serves as a source of employment for over 20,000 new graduates who will be engaged in maintaining the project's facilities, which include power stations, water infrastructure, wastewater treatment plants, and other related jobs. In this way, the new Delta project not only addresses the immediate water crisis, but also contributes to reducing the impacts of climate change and desertification, offering a ray of hope for Egypt's agricultural sector and its economy. Innovative water management is also at the heart of Egypt's new Delta project. Contrary to the expectation of using the Nile River for irrigation, the project adopts forward-thinking strategies, mainly recycling various types of wastewater to meet the large water needs. The centerpiece of this approach is the Alum Water Treatment Plant, currently under construction. This advanced facility is designed to supply an impressive 7.5 million cubic meters of water daily for the project. The plant's capacity to treat and provide wastewater for reuse is a crucial part of the project's sustainability. Moreover, the new Delta project draws additional water resources from two other wastewater treatment plants located near Giza on the 6th of October city. These interconnected facilities demonstrate the project's commitment to efficient water resource utilization. The project has opted not to invest in seawater desalination plants. While desalination is an effective means of producing fresh water, it is often considered expensive due to the considerable expenses involved. Instead, the project focuses on maximizing the reuse and recycling of available water resources, thereby minimizing the demand for expensive desalination processes. The connection to the Nile River is a significant element of the project, although not in the way one might initially assume. It serves as an emergency water source, acting as a safety net in case of issues with the Ethiopian Renaissance Dam. The artificial river, an impressive 114 kilometers long, is designed to provide approximately 10 million cubic meters of water daily. An interesting aspect is that this artificial river is situated at a higher elevation than the Nile River. This means that it cannot directly contribute to the Nile's flow unless the Nile experiences a significant rise in water levels. In such cases, emergency gates and tunnels are incorporated into the project's design to manage the excess water efficiently. We have established that the new Delta project is a massive undertaking in the planning stages since 2006. This long planning period shows the complexity and size of the project. It involves extensive research and careful preparation as it covers vast areas designed to accommodate millions of people, along with the development of power stations, food production facilities, commercial zones, and expansive farmland. What's truly interesting about this project is the beacon of hope it represents for Egypt. It offers the country a unique opportunity to regain its status as a net exporter of food commodities and foodstuffs. As a result, the project has attracted the interest of multinational corporations, including those from China, which see it as a promising venture for future expansion and profit. Interestingly, while a project of this scale might carry a price tag of around $50 billion in places like America or Europe, Egypt has managed to find efficient and sustainable methods to make it a reality at a fraction of that cost. This cost effectiveness is due to the availability of cheaper labor and materials within Egypt, making the project more financially feasible and accessible for the country. The new Delta project is strategically located in the Daba Axis area, previously a barren desert landscape. This region had minimal development, with only one main highway connecting it to the airports in Alexandria and Cairo. The choice of this location carries the potential for significant regional development and improved accessibility. One of the project's most exciting features is the 114-kilometer-long artificial river, which is being promoted as the world's longest. In reality, this river extends to 170 kilometers as it connects to a new canal originating from the old delta. This canal feeds the Alum wastewater plant, ensuring a fresh water supply for the new artificial river. The artificial river is a truly amazing engineering feat, comprising 148 kilometers of open concrete canals, 22 kilometers of underground pipelines with diameters up to 3 meters, 15 lift stations to address elevation changes, and 39 bridges for both vehicles and pedestrians. The new Delta project also taps into an extraordinary underground waste source beneath the western desert of Egypt. This massive underground reservoir extends more than 2,000 meters deep 
and supplies shallower reservoirs ranging from 100 to 400 meters deep. These reservoirs have varying thicknesses, ranging from 120 to 900 meters. To access this vast source, over 100 wells have been established, providing a remarkable 2.5 million cubic meters of fresh underground water for the project. By creating the world's largest artificial river and implementing innovative solutions, Egypt is taking vital steps to provide water for its expanding population. This project not only secures water resources, but also promises a sustainable and hopeful future for the nation.